Well, now we've been we've been curing your panic attacks, and we've cured a bunch of other things. We've cured you cured a flu and a headache right on camera, and then we proceeded on to cure your panic attacks. And and uh, are you still having panic attacks? Uh, well, yes, sometimes, but. When was the mo when was the last time you had one? About maybe two, three days ago. But I kind of told them panic attacks. It's just panic attacks. So you mean they start to come on, and then you you, you you're able to deal with them better? They, yes. Or you just don't you're not as susceptible to the full extent of them anymore? Mm -hmm. I can control myself. Very well, I would say very well. Oh, well, oh, well that's uh, that's good to hear. <laughs> Yay! Yeah. You look great. It's amazing. Yeah, you do look great. Yeah, that's also true. Yeah, that's great. Okay. Um, well, well, I'm very pleased with how this is going. Now, how long have you been working on this with us? Do you have any idea? Look, how many right. how many weeks? About how many weeks have you been working on this with us? Wow. So maybe four months, maybe three months. Three months, I think. Okay, so about so about twelve weeks. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, good. So what I want you to do now is go through the pathologies and check for those. Let's start that way. Okay. Okay. Uh, here, I'll help you. Do we have any pathologies in any of my bodies? Do I have any my do I have any virus? I'll go, I'll go through each of them. Is there any virus in any of my bodies? They look real clear, I must say. No, no virus, bacteria. You're an advanced immune or so you can just like remove it as soon as you get a yes. I'm removing bacteria from all my bodies. Uh, um. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't have a signal. Oh, okay. Again. <laughs> you don't have a signal at all, or you just got to know that you don't have any bacteria. <laughs> uh, how about, uh, let's ask, oh my gosh, let's see, do you have any rot in any of my bodies? What? Rot. Okay, I got no two. Do you have any parasites? No. Uh, any fungus? No. Okay. Um, we have not fungus. What else is there? Um. Okay, do I have any retention? Okay, any substance uh, accident? Any substance okay. excess or deficiency? Do I have any substance excess or deficiency in any of my bodies? It's one of the pathologies. Yeah, I know. I haven't done one for a while. It, I forget that one. It's pretty. It's important too. It's like when you're high or low, or something. It could be like. No, I think it's more than nothing. It's just. Let's really? well, just try to get connected first. Um, maybe that there is a camera. I was telling Sarah. I went outside the other day, and I feel something very strange. She felt the same. Kind of creepy. Okay, let's clear the spirit. Clear any interference or any attack and see if you can reconnect with the harmonic and get your signal. 
I'm connected with my ability to cure things. Say that. And to know things. That's my ability to know things. I'm going to have to take a That's weird. Um, so you see, are you wanting anything? Say some things you're wanting. No. You're not wanting anything. <coughs> okay. You can use the Terry Grover method. You can clap your hands. That, that always helps. <laughs> <laughs> Clears things. And then see, and then try again, see if you can get a signal. But I'm connecting with God, say, or connected with my angels. I feel a little resistance too, but I'm just trying to push through it. No, I can't. Wow. Ooh, what, should, what should we do? Um, let's see. Um, are you in a trauma? Test if you're am I in a trauma? Is there any open trauma? It's hard to test and switched. I just think I saw a spirit behind you. <laughs> oh, shit, no. <laughs> Where's Cholo? No, Where's it? Where is it? Because I saw something. Really... <laughs> That's the second time I saw it. Well, one time your dad was in there. Oh, no. just... <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. I'm get it. Yeah. Huh? It's a test to see if I can handle it. Okay, okay. Um, so, um, all my bodies are free of pathology. That's what I clear it first. <sighs> yeah. All my bodies are free of immune dysfunction. What do we need to get? I have lost my signal. It's just funny. I mean, when's the last time? When's, when's the last time you got a signal? Because actually, last time we talked, we I, I couldn't get a signal with you either. Okay. It was. Oh, uh, back. I'm just morning. Just no more Oh, good. Cleaning at all every day. Mm -hmm. And uh, you clean your bodies every day. Yeah. Do you still do all your organ clearing every day? Everything, like, um, you know, like, get up in the morning, go to the shower, that's the first thing I do is just clean everything around me. Nice. So that's your routine? Well, tell me some more about what your routine is. Sorry. You tell me more about your routine. So now you you clear all your bodies, you clear your organs. Yes. Yeah. The only thing about it, even um, I'm doing a little walk on my own outside. Oh, nice. You going for a yes. walk? It's just the pain of the weather. <laughs> Sweet. But normally I'm, I'm feeling very energy. Like yesterday I was, you know, I was so surprised of myself. Doing many things. I went shopping, you know, and wow. cleaning and cooking and... Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, I went to the park for a little while. Wow. And I was it I think most, most people watching might not know that that's really a big change for you. Like for a while, you weren't going to leave your room. Oh, you know, like that's awesome. Quiet. That's quiet. Quiet. That's really cool. That Here. really is. I must give you a big, hearty congratulations. Thank you for getting down, <laughs> at getting out and doing something for yourself. I'm proud of you. Yeah, thank you so much, and I'm very proud of myself. I know there are really things, very cool. Yeah, she does it every day now. 
You're an example. You're an example. You're an example to all of us. You are. You're a good example for all of us. Yeah. I, I, I will say sometimes I have really bad days, but I try to remember the good days and then I just like I said off relief, trying to, you know, redact and but sometimes I lose the talk myself. I can't I can't concentrate. Oh, you're like a new person, it's amazing. Yes, really. That's you. You are like a new person. You are like you're like a totally different person. You should see your, fa your face. Your face is different. <laughs> your fa your face is different. Really. Uh -huh. It is. Yeah, it's some makeup on that way. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, and I feel I feel more calm with myself, and like I wake up in the morning and I see the birds and make me smile. You know, things like that. That's Hmm. That's how I feel in the morning too, and that's how I feel oh. every day. I think that you have done some substantial curing. Mm -hmm. Tru truly, <laughs> in two, in three months, three months you've been doing this. That's pretty amazing. Yeah. Well, you've you've worked hard. <laughs> You've worked hard. It was in front of me on the on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. We put it there on the internet in front of you so you could do it. Yeah. That's why we put it there. That's why we make movies with people so that you know you they can see what you've done and be inspired and do it too. It's hard, believe me. At the beginning, it's hard to understand or maybe to believe. Yeah. No, I mean, between, um, I would, I would speak about myself. No, I don't believe in anything. But at the beginning, but now I believe in everything, especially if I can, I can feel myself every single day much better. So. You know, I still don't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> And also, also belief is an immune dysfunction. It's on the list of immune dysfunctions. So I don't think I want to believe it. I just want to experience it and keep taking my next step forward. Yeah, keep taking your next steps. Well, um, go back to uh, you know, like let's let's see if you um, can. Um, I have another question though. Like if you. Uh, because you touched on this, if you were to give like uh, tips to someone else that was in your position, you know, three months ago, what else would you tell them? If they have somebody that was just starving or, or just um, you know. Bad. Yeah, I would try to you know make that person understand and you know go with you the crazy people on internet. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. It's honestly, it's just like. Um, I have to tell, you know, and even I've been doing that. I mean, and actually, actually you, did, you, did, you did everything right in terms of you immersed yourself. You got into the web college, you talked to me almost every single day, you went to all the meetings, and you worked on your own. So. And actually, I'm so, another, no, I'm practically, and I told you about you guys because if I'm not going to lie to them. Uh -huh. mm. and, but the people they still think uh, oh my god, just you are lying or whatever. And so you can see for yourself, go on YouTube if you can check. There's no more people like you and me or anybody else. Oh, cool. I like to help people what they need. Yeah, you are. You helped me. You help you are you are like a you're definitely a helper. Okay, so well when we get more people curing panic attack next time I'll let you be on the movies with me. All right, let's see if we can get a signal. I am connecting with my ability to cure things. I'm connecting, let's connect with God. Connecting with all there is. The harmonic and all there is. There you go. Yay. <laughs> Yay. That was going to be tricky. Okay. Um, I'm removing all pathologies from all my bodies. Okay. 
Nice. You got your stigma back. Yay. Um, do I have any open trauma from the last few days? <clears throat> okay, do I have any uh, um, uh, knowledge, all the uh, pathologies? Let me see. Do I have any? Um, I'm gonna have to go to the website on my list. Hang on. Problem. <laughs> uh, let's Spark, see. keep printouts by your computer. Yeah. <laughs> now, um, Alejandra, while she's good getting that, I want you to test. I noticed that you like put your hand in front of you face just now and I want you to test is that a symptom no. okay good Barb you got it yet yeah I got it do I have any scarring in any of my bodies <laughs> no okay do I have any deform Deformity. Yeah, I think I did it. Okay. I'm like the other day. What? I had a kind of prostate the other day. I'm the one on the right. Oh. I hope you did it. The thing, the good news about you, you know, curing your panic attacks or getting a handle on that is you can, you know, start to function again. And now, in a way, the work really starts. Like, in a way, it's not over now. Like, there's a lot of, uh, you know, applications of immunics that are now about you and going on the rest of your life and what's going to happen next. So, um, but let's go more on these pathologies. Uh, do I have any uh, particle attribute imbalance? Okay, so bring all your particle attributes back into balance. I have that too. Thank you. You're a good tester. I'm balancing all my particle attributes. Is how we can do this. It's a very long list. We could go through this sometime. Okay. <clears throat> okay. So, great. Uh, do you have any negative beingness? Put many. Yes. No. Did you get yes? Yes. Okay. I'm removing negative things from my spot. Let's, let's do it from each body. Let's, I'm removing negative things from my gravitational body. The good thing about you is you're, uh, very, your testing is very honest. That's what I always realized. I noticed that from you early on. You, you get very honest answers. Um, okay, so I have a negative beingness in my spiral body. Yeah. Okay, let's remove it from your spiral body. I'm removing negative beingness from my spiral body. Okay. Okay, do I have it in my emotional body? Moving negative beingness, all traces of negative beingness from my emotional body now. Oops. Okay. Great. Um, do I have it in my mental body? The negative beingness in my mental body? Yeah. Okay. Um, removing negative beingness from my mental body. Finger moves. I have done that. Have, okay. have you Do you feel a difference? 
Yeah? Yep. Great. Uh, do you feel any different? Yeah. <laughs> Let's change. Less negative, right? <laughs> yeah, less negative. Let's go. <laughs> less attached. What's different? What else is different? I've been feeling relaxing today. I was yeah, no more. Is that good? Uh oh, Karen left the tea on. What is that? Ah! It's a bomb! Karen left the tea on. Here she comes. My trusty assistant. Oh, there she is. Okay. Um. Okay. Let's for that. Wow. Okay. So let's see. Do you have negative beingness in it, uh, any of your other bodies? Do you have any in your etheric body? Good. Do you have it in your celestial body? How about your um, astral body? Okay, all my bodies are free of negative beingness. see what other pathologies you might possibly have. Uh, deformity. Yeah. Do you have a dip? No. no. Almost. No. What? Fear. Fears. Um, ask, almost everybody has this one, but let's see. Do I have any conditions? Do I have any conditions? Good, good. Some examples of a condition are, I get a lot of conditions like, <clears throat> anyway, okay, good. You don't have any conditions right now that need to be addressed. We will go with your testing. Okay, do you have any organ problems? Any substance excess or deficiency? All my bodies are free of pathologies. Yes? Yeah. Great, 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 great. Okay, so how do you feel now? Familiar sigh. Okay, so um, you're relaxed. Yeah. Yeah, you feel relaxed. It seems like you're um, pretty. How would you describe your state right now? I'm bored. I need to go up. <laughs> She's ready for the next thing. She's go up. I'm bored. That's cool. Yeah, I I've been be myself. Very, you know, pushing us, relaxing. Well, okay, this is, I think that, that that boredom is good. I think it's a good, yeah, that's the kind of boredom that's good for I think me. it's a good thing. That's, yeah, it's, it's a, restless. It's a creative okay. state. Yeah. But normally, I, I do enjoy to be in my room, you know, do my work or anything. But now I can tell to be inside my room. <laughs> <laughs> nice. So, and see, and, and, and staying, yeah. staying in your room all day was one of your symptoms when you were having panic attacks. You lived, yeah. you didn't want to leave your room. Yeah. So this is a very big change for you. Yeah. 
now you don't like being in the room. That, well, I want you to do an accelerator. <clears throat> okay. So, Bar so Barb, so go to the accelerator and start with, you know, you've already asked how she's different, and then just go on from there. Okay. Um, how you are now, do you, do you see anything in your life, well, one thing is going out, but anything that might be easier? Oh, oh, sorry. Um, do you, are, are there any things that might be easier now that, uh, or, or that were, are possible for you now that weren't possible before? There's many things, many. Many things? Tell me. Family around myself, all the place I, I go, many things. It can be little things for me, and, but I mean, it can be little, little things for other people. You know, no, no, here for you, it's, it, whatever is for you. Yeah, I, go, I get up in the morning, you know, go for a walk. Sometimes I used to go just in the corner. I live in a corner house. I used to go in the corner and go first by the way with any cat. Oh. Come on. <laughs> but now, can turn around and then you know I can keep walking a little, you know, and then go back. Cool. Wow. Yes. Free. 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 Yes. 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 Now I enjoy everything I do. I just I had the wrong idea to make a cake. I should not make a cake. <laughs> <laughs> but it turned very nice. Why was it wrong? Because you ate it off? <laughs> no, no, no. But well, I love cake, but I don't eat it. Okay. <laughs> I know it's there. You know, it's like my mind is telling me. Oh, I, I'm here. So you're a lot more active than you were. You seem a lot more. You seem a lot more active than you were when I first met you. Like you seem more uh, upbeat, I get it. And more, more productive. More. Yeah, like you get more done every day, more accomplished. Nice. Um, what else did you just have? You, what have you discovered about yourself? Or, or, is, is there anything that you discovered that? Um, you didn't know before? Uh, well, I, I think I have more confidence. I, I, was, I wasn't shy, but I feel I feel more confident right now. Yeah. Because we all have been going through, it just makes me feel more power with actually with other people. Right, more personal power. Yeah, you were just like to say. I can tell right. from what you I can tell from what you've told me that when you you know prior to when you were sick you were you know like a powerful active person and then you were just disabled for a while so now you're back you're like you're sort of back to your old self again well, that's good um are and there maybe some deeper crazy jealousy means maybe some things but that's right I used I used to to because before I used to play all day, you know, because of my drink, you know, I didn't know how to handle it, so I cried, and now I can't cry. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, maybe I just cried too much of everything. I feel, it took, I don't know, I'm angry at everything, that's the main thing, enjoy what I, I'm doing. Well, you look beautiful, and I can see that you're doing something with your energy that's really rejuvenating yourself, so that's really great. Um, tell me this, um, are there any old behaviors or responses that you, um, uh, old behaviors or responses that you can move away from, like behaviors that were working for you? Uh, well, you mentioned one, like staying in your room all day or crying a lot, but is there anything else that, um, well, I still have the, the feeling fear about 
what to do by him. Yeah, yeah. But it, feel it in, inside of me. Right, right. Like, one, one thing I know about you is that you're, yeah, you're more like in the moment, like you don't think, worry about it, you, the future as much. I mean, you think about what if I have it if I go out, or what if I have it? Every time when I go out, I just thinking, oh, what's happening if I'm home? What's happening if I'm Then, slowly, slowly, I think I'm calling the panic. Okay, I'm, I'm the one who bring my panic. Mm -hmm. But now I'm trying not to forget my mind, you know, fear of that. Right, right, right. So and do you feel like you have more control? And the more, you know, all my... Hmm? Do you feel like you have more control over the outcomes or how you... Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice. Like, actually this morning when I wake up, I was feeling breezy. And then I thought, you know, really, that's okay, Alex, you know, all right, it's just like adrenaline going up and down, because it's me. Mm -hmm. And then, and then I could sit in the lab and you know, enjoy my tea, and inside me, it's so long, okay, and now it's not. Yeah, it seems like you're enjoying your life more. That's cool. Um, do you do you see more ideas about things you can achieve um, in your life, or things that can I'm make a make happen? I'm I'm still working. Yeah. Making a new vision, like next steps. What would be some of your next steps? Do you think? To win seventy million dollars. <laughs> <laughs> no, I heard about that. Five two. I have. I'm being. I'm in the panic attack and in my in my work for so many years. I wanna do many things but I'm not really that careful. Mm -hmm. So if I start doing something or anything, so I always go, you know, slow. Right. You know. So if I like to you know kind of be secure if I do something. So each day you would say you're you're moving you're like you're taking like little next steps to like. I'm going to every little step I make. So then I can, you know, when I'm very, you know, sure about something, I will. Oh, right, I will jump. Mm-hmm. You do seem more curious and more like uh, adventurous, like you're experiment, being more experimental, trying new things, doing new things. That's cool. Um, uh, let's see, do you, uh, Tess, are you more, res are, tell me ways you're more responsible, like able to respond, are you more responsible? So what do you mean? Well, uh, like able to respond to the things that you couldn't respond to before, or, uh, let's see, um, could be in your relationships, or in your work, or in your, uh, your exercise routine, or your, your um, so, I mean, I'm always responsible in that situation. Yeah, you seem responsible. My family. And I have to. Yeah, you're. I don't know what I have to spend Yeah, because you're kind of the head of your family. It's one of the big moments of the house. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I'm not the head. It's just. It's like, a, you know, I'm the, I'm the old one. <laughs> yes. Yes. Maybe you're more responsible. But I have. I love. Well, actually, I know what what you seem to, what seems different about you is you seem less resentful about that, like more responsible that that's your your role and your job and you can um, delegate. I'm relaxing. I will say more relaxed. Or uh, to, to, you know, think and uh, just if they, I'm not gonna say you know something like my always say. Look, Alex, you everything is there, you Okay, you know what cook today? Don't cook. <laughs> Oh, I would just, you know, kind of, you know, kind of sort of stretching myself for no reason. So you give yourself, give yourself more of a break. So, no, my dad is, you know, that piece of work. It's <laughs> 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 He's your ally. I test your dad is your good friend and your ally. It is. It is. Yeah. Yeah, he's cool. I'm right. going or something. Okay, let me see here. Uh, do you see any way... 
that anything could interfere with your progress or, or set you back or anything could, um, uh, um, can you look ahead and pr like sort of think about what you have to be prepared for or uh, watch out for so you don't have setbacks? Mm -hmm. I really am not. I have to be very careful about jealousy. Mm -hmm. Other people's jealousy towards you, you mean? Yeah. Yeah, I hate to be more protective about who you are around or how you handle their responses to you. Well, uh, I'm, I would say, okay, I'm not that person, but uh, I hope to be, you know, with people with nice feelings, not of yourself and and uh, I do like actually not in fight. <laughs> I, I noticed that about you. I learned that the hard way. Yeah, you learn how to protect yourself. That's good. That's good. Um let's see, let's see, what else? Well this is really exciting that you your job doing so well. Um <coughs> what have you what else have you learned about, um, here we go. I've been learning all the time, well, normally, uh, we don't eat any rice, I think I said that, I don't know, whatever, things like that, but I'm now really, leave things like that to make you harm very bad, so, yeah, so. Your family's been changing the way they, they've been eating? Hmm? Your family's changing the way they're eating? Uh, no, I haven't thought, because, mm -hmm. um, you know, bad food. People in my house are like, you know, fast food. Oh, fast And that's once a month, maybe, or once every two months. But sometimes it's just, but I mean, trying, everybody's just eating something right now. You know, my son. It's all I agree. No. Yeah. No, I have to say your 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 energy is totally different. So we we'll have to compare yeah, to your Yeah, you look great. You look whatever you're doing is working. So very good. I think you're good. <laughs> the fact that you're, and that, yeah, I'm glad. And that the, that you're getting out of the house and getting a little fresh air and you know just even a short walk makes such a difference. Like a, like everything around me, such you know, getting back when I was maybe. More than 50 years ago, it's like, you know, it's, it's, it's everything, they just come back again. So, I'm, I'm very, happy, very happy. That's why I feel happy because I feel like I'm happy. It's just in the world to me, you know, even yeah, my son. That's, that is true. I notice your son is a lot happier too. Because he's so connected to you, he must be happy to see you healthier. Yes, yeah. really so, cool. I'm doing this. For my staff and for my family, like when they say the cry, you know. Yeah. I think I'm going for myself and for my family and for my friends. Thank you. <laughs> you did. And I hope I consider myself among your friends. Everybody in Facebook. I don't know them. I didn't know. <laughs> when you come to, that, come to America, you will have lots of friends if you ever come here. Uh, let's see, what else? Well, this is very inspiring. You've inspired me. Uh, 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 uh. Do you have, uh, other than winning, winning the lottery, do you have any other visions for yourself that you that are easier to see now than before? Like, like
like a, a vision for you. <laughs> what? <laughs> I've got some babies, I'm sure of that. You have some babies? Oh, good. Yeah. That would be so nice. Mm. Have babies. To meet the love of your life and move to America. Okay, well. Cool. The son's going to give you some grandchildren. Yeah, yeah. That's too late to give right now. You don't want to have kids. Kids are loud. You just don't want to have kids again. Yeah. yeah. Are there any things you've been avoiding or uh, delaying that you could start doing now? Any other things that you've been putting putting off? Not really. Glad you just started going for your walks. That was something you were putting off months ago, but now you're doing it. Fine, next, next go to the city. <laughs> if I can have the a few old people to yeah, probably go to the city like once a week. So I'm going. Like, <laughs> yeah. You seem to have fun every time you go. The city. You know, I'm, I'm being during the day, you know. Where oh, I see. That'd be fun. That first walk in the public, they look mad, you know. They look mad. Mm -hmm. When I used to live near New York. Yeah. When I used to live near New York, I used to just go and just walk around just because it was fun. Just to walk around in the city. It felt so good to walk around and, you know, just look at things even from the outside. If I lived near Melbourne I'd probably do the same thing. Uh what okay, um, in what ways have you become more loving and connected to God? Since the last two months. I've always been connected to God in some way, in, in other ways. I never, you know, go to the church. Okay? I don't know. Church is the church, and uh, I see so many dead people inside the house. So, you know, I believe what I believe, and I, I think I ought to be connected to them. Inside of me, I have that, you know, I'm not going to say that more, but it's the love to God, or the love to people, the, you know, love is everywhere, it's not in some place, and I think when I you know, even going outside, or like, see the big ocean, and that's right. what I think. Yeah. Right. But yeah, I remember when we first met you, you were saying how you, I could tell how happy you were. You were saying how you had been praying for a long time to, for some kind of solution to your situation. So yeah, every so, day, you know, yeah, pray to the you know to God. Yeah, you know, to everybody. Well, now that you have a good connection with your angels, <laughs> you do. I want to break in here because we only have a few minutes. And there's something that I want you to test for. It's new behaviors. And uh, so what I want you to do is say some behaviors that you think you, it would be good to, for you to construct and adopt and then test them. So, Bob, do that, okay, with Alejandra. Uh, some new behaviors. Uh, constructing new behaviors. So can you just... Can you think of any that come up? Otherwise, I could try to suggest some. To be stronger? What do you mean? Like physically stronger or emotionally or do we? Emotional and, um, yeah, it's not um, emotional thing. My, my panic, any, any anxiety is not emotional. To be better than that. Yeah. Yeah. Test it. Test it. Test. So test, is that... I mean, and Barb, you should test it system. also. Yeah, I'm getting that. Uh, it's, it's good for you to just n know that. It's like a knowing. To, to That's know a response. Too strong. You are more powerful than the panic attacks that you can just decide how your day's going to go or what's going to happen if you go out. That you're going to just have a good time. And my, be in control of how you my feel. My test of be, being strong is an, a good new response that's now it's easier. Being, is being strong a good new response for Alejandro? That's yes. easier now. It's become easy. It will become easier now, yes. Okay, so now look for behaviors. Behaviors. Responses come up, though. That's fine. 
that they come up on. Look for behavior. The behavior. What's the behavior like? Uh, hmm. Let's see. Uh, Our behavior would be um, doing things that earn money, for example. You, like you, could, uh, like you could you could test specific things, things you know that behaviors are like let's say you made a um, goal to to uh, do a certain amount of business each day or month or whatever that's true that's a business that's a behavior like to be more I see it was quite entrepreneurial actually like you're a good businesswoman to uh, yeah take control of your um, you know have an extra yeah, behaviors would a behavior would be goal daily goal setting would be a behavior. That's okay. that's, an, that's an example yeah. of a behavior goals, daily goal like setting. Like make a certain amount of calls or a certain amount of uh, contacts or a certain amount of sales, you know that kind of thing. Or, or like you know, go go for go for your walk every day or twice a day. Those things are behaviors. Um, yeah, that, that, those are good ones for me too. Like yeah, those now that you're well. It, Whatever, whatever you were putting off before, that you, things that you can do now that you couldn't do before. Make new, you know, you, you new friends, go out with your friends, or, you know, mm -hmm. clients, you know, different clients that you couldn't meet before and talk to as easily. Does, does that tend for you? Yeah. yeah. Great. Um, um, come to America. <laughs> behavior. Um, what else? New behaviors. How's your relationship with your mother going? You see, any, are you been, have you been different in that? Are you more direct? I'm a queen, so I put it to her like a queen, so two, two, five. Yeah. No, she's a challenge, I think. She's a challenge. That's good. Do it. Yeah. Have more fun with her. Okay. Glad you're having fun. How about, uh, the other people of your, in your life, has that been going better? Yeah, I don't have problems. Yeah, you have friends. I feel we're laughing with other people, you know. I have good friends, like I said, and I have, you know, bad people I try to, you know, talk to them, you know, not talk to them. To them out. Yeah. Well, I, I, I hope that some yeah yeah that someday you could um, find people in your community or the Chilean community that might want to uh, yeah. learn, learn people that want to learn in Munich that maybe wouldn't be able to do it without a, a yeah. coach that that speaks Spanish you help them because you speak Spanish that'd be cool. Mm -hmm. okay. Uh, all right, well, yeah, that's fine. Right. Sometimes when I go in on the internet, you know, I actually need to talk to people about it. Yeah. But really, you know, going to check out the videos, but I can't yeah. just be talking to yeah. yeah. people. Yeah. Yeah. People just need to be reminded that they can connect and, you know, find their own way and get their information. Yeah. And I think if they have someone who speaks Spanish, sometimes that would help them. Yeah, I can help. Cool. I know, I'm going to start a group here and I'm sure there'll be more Spanish speaking people who will be able to keep you on Skype. Okay, well thank you. You have been a real pleasure. I'm glad I met you and I'm glad we worked together. This is a really successful... And I'm going to... I'll be out. I'm going to be out. I'm going to be out. That's okay. It's fine, and I'm, I'm sure it's not the last I'll talk to you. But I feel like it was. It's, it's good that got some closure on this, and that you've done so well. You know, Alejandro, I, have, I have, <coughs> wanted to say that I, I feel as though you're a cure team member. Yeah, I am. I can ask You know, we have we have other members who can't make the meetings on Friday, so you want you aren't the only one who doesn't. And, and just con just continue to talk to everybody on Facebook, okay? You, mm -hmm. you can stay in touch with the Cure team that way. Mm -hmm. I will. And also, <laughs> what did you say, sweetie? 
What what'd you say? Said she'll, said she'll keep doing that. Okay, all right. And she uh, says yes, Cap she said yes, Captain. She just grew up. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and and also and also keep contributing. Thank you for your contributions. And please keep contributing. It makes a difference and it, it uh, we feel um, you know it's it's you know it's more than the money you give you re you're giving us uh, a boost. You know you're. It's very empowering. I really think I have always appreciated. I've been learning yeah. a lot. And come on, look at me. I feel much better. Come on, I have. <laughs> oh, I'm not good thank you. Well, we will make another movie soon. Okay, that's no all. Okay, guys, I'll speak to you guys later. Uh, okay, thank you. Okay, bye. Okay. Okay. Well, that was good. This movie was given to you by HUM, the World Ministry of Immunics, which enables you to cure medically incurable diseases. We also produce the Cure Drive in the iCollege of Immunics. This is the home page. And as you see here, the movie that starts playing automatically when the page opens is a three-hour tutorial film, which underneath it is a, the beginning of a series of movies. And if you click on these links, uh, you go to another movie that's a continuation of the tutorial, uh, showing different aspects of uh, the things that people need to get into when they cure things. The movie shows many people curing things. You'll find complete cure tutorials on the home page. Um, under the group at the top is another. Uh, this is a video and text tutorial. And uh, if you click on the link, uh, you'll see it has 10 lessons. And you can click on the, each lesson and you'll see it that the lessons are movies interspersed with explanations. And if you continue scrolling down the home page, you'll find a huge bank of movies of people curing things. Here's one of someone curing multiple sclerosis that you can click on and these play. Hopefully this one will play in a moment. There it is. <laughs> so that woman cured uh, PPMS and MS. Here you'll find people from every continent, Europe, the U.S., Asia, Canada. This woman cured shingles in this particular movie. She, that's what she's uh, demonstrating. And at the top of the home page, you will find links to the uh, cure meetings that we have every week. Um, 9 p.m. New York time, Rome time, 8 p.m. Underneath the cure meetings, uh, you'll find a link to friend me. It's actually Bayard. I'm Bayard speaking to you on Facebook. And you'll meet many people who are my Facebook friends there who have cured various diseases. Many of us have cured herpes, which is what I cured. Also, there, if you have trouble getting signals, there is a uh, whole bank of movies that focus on people who are just starting to get their first signals. Uh, many of these people went on to bigger and better things, and you see them in other movies. But these are movies about their signals how they got their first signals. At the very top of the home page, you will find above the uh, masthead a link to the cure shows. And we uh, documented people curing things on, these are on, the, we did this on the phone. There are shows on about 75 diseases and the diseases are listed alphabetically, as you can see. Uh, you actually hear the people curing these diseases 
during these shows. Uh, that's post-traumatic stress syndrome from 9-11, you know, the uh, catastrophe. Uh, we have a show on that and fever, somebody curing the fever. Several people curing fibromyalgia, flu. We had a flu hotline and there are many people. These people are actually curing flu and the flu stops. It clears up during the 15 or 20 minutes of the call. It doesn't take long to cure the flu. Uh, over here you have uh, paralysis, parasitic parenting, Parkinson's disease. When you cure something, please uh, join your voice with the voices of the many people who came before you by reporting your cure in our poll which you can do right above the tally of the cures that people have reported is here at the top and as you can see there's a little link here and if you click on that you will come to a form that enables you to report your cure this page is the hub of the web college and as you can see there are uh, detailed lessons on how to remove viruses cure cancer and trauma recode your DNA reclaim your organs and other issues that people are interested in such as the safety web these are the main lessons of the web college and there are also movies here uh, here's a movie on the right here of a doctor who actually years ago cured the flu on camera. So you can click on these two and play he's doing he's demonstrating how he's doing it. They filmed him in his office. <laughs> We've tried to provide you with everything you need here and I wish you happy curing. Please be in touch with us.